Arsenal make decision on Rwanda sponsorship after court rules against asylum policy. Arsenal have had a sponsorship deal in place with Visit Rwanda since 2018 and the club have no plans to cancel it despite a UK Supreme Court ruling stating the country has a poor human rights record. Arsenal launched their Visit Rwanda sponsorship in 2018 and renewed it in 2021. Arsenal launched their Visit Rwanda sponsorship in 2018 and renewed it in 2021. Image, Cyril Ndjia slash AFP, by Getty Images. News. Politics. Football. Celebs. TV. Choice. Royals. By Matthew Cooper Sports Writer. 8 o'clock, November 16, 2023 Updated 10 colon 53. November 16, 2023. Arsenal are not planning to end their Visit Rwanda sponsorship deal, despite the UK Supreme Court ruling that Rwanda is not a safe country to send asylum seekers to. The government had been planning to deport asylum seekers to Rwanda, but the court ruled that there were substantial grounds to believe they would face a real risk of ill treatment and that Rwanda has a poor human rights record. It was ruled that most human rights violations were said to be linked to criticisms of the Rwandan government. While Supreme Court President Lord Robert Reid also said there was a real risk Rwanda could send asylum seekers back to the countries they fled from. The Rwandan government, however, said in a statement it takes issue with the ruling that Rwanda is not a safe third country for asylum seekers and refugees and insists they are committed to its international obligations. Arsenal's visit Rwanda sponsorship and the dark side to a hideous sports washing agenda. Visit Rwanda deal strikes wrong note for Arsenal as sports don't care where cash is from. Arsenal have come in for criticism for the lucrative sponsorship deal with Rwanda's tourism board in the past, having first partnered with Visit Rwanda in 2018 before signing another four-year deal worth £10 million per year in 2021. The Visit Rwanda logo is emblazoned Arsenal shirt sleeves, training equipment and on the advertising hoardings at the Emirates with the nation's authoritarian president Paul Kagame, a fan of the club. Paris Saint-Germain and Bayern Munich also have similar sponsorship deals with Visit Rwanda. And according to a report from The Athletic, no changes are anticipated to Arsenal's deal in the wake of the Supreme Court's ruling. The Visit Rwanda logo is emblazoned on Arsenal shirts and training equipment. The Visit Rwanda logo is emblazoned on Arsenal shirts and training equipment, image. Jakub Porzicki slash Nerfoto via Getty Images. In a statement provided to Mirror Football last year, the club defended the sponsorship, highlighting an increase in the country's tourism revenue they say helps lifting thousands out of poverty and empowering citizens. A spokesperson said, since our partnership began in 2018, we have worked together to tell Rwanda's story of culture, heritage and transition, as well as raising awareness of the country as a holiday destination. One year after the partnership began, Rwanda's tourism revenue increased by 17% and tourists from Europe increased by 22%. This increase supports the growth of Rwanda's economy, creating more revenue they can reinvest across all key sectors, lifting thousands out of poverty, and empowering citizens. This is where we will continue our focus as Rwanda continues its post-pandemic recovery.